Our highest priority at the college is surgical excellence, point blank period. When we are talking about equity, it is necessary if we are going to achieve excellence. So we're not undermining, we are not um, uh, negotiating, and we are not supporting anything but surgical excellence in this work. Hopefully by the time we finish speaking with you today, you'll see why equity is necessary if we're going to achieve this goal. So first and foremost, we want everyone to know this isn't new. Starting way back, I mean, like two decades ago, the Institute of Medicine in 2001 identified, as you all know, the six domains of quality. Equity was one of those domains. So when we hear people saying this is new or new initiative, new direction, different direction, it's not new. Now, have we explored it fully? No, but that's what we're here to start um, today. And we hope to work with you in a longitudinal fashion ongoing such that you can understand how to integrate equity into the work that you do. And so just another visual about the equal versus um, equitable comparison. Um, this one has to do with our, our plants that you see here receiving equal portions of light and hydration on my left and then equitable portions resources according to need on the right. And you can see the cactus receiving maximum light, lower hydration is thriving. You can see that the flower receiving medium light, medium hydration is thriving. And the fern receiving low light, maximum hydration is thriving versus the equal portion distribution on the left, right? So are we going to be mad at the cactus for running up the light bill? Or are we going to charge the fern for running up the water bill? No, what we're recognizing is the needs and we're addressing those needs accordingly. And when we do so, we're able to create a culture that includes environmental and psychological safety because everyone knows they'll be supported with the resources they need. They'll feel like they belong. And as a result, people will be able to show up authentically, perform maximally. And for us, maximum performance means surgical excellence, the provision of surgical excellence for our patients in whatever role we play.